nobody there you go I think once you start broadcasting your first time you get your channel option either that I was just retarded and didn't see it but you just go to your channel should shouldn't be able to hear me customizing your channel you guys can do that on your own time I'm not going to show you how to broadcast I got a viewer but that's probably me oops don't need that alright so Basically, this is how I do it. You go to your channel, see how it's all widescreen and stuff, because I told you to keep aspect and whatnot. Whatever. You just click this little gear box right here on the chat. I don't know if you can see. Oh, yeah, you can see it. I keep thinking that I'm streaming, and then you can't see over here. Anyways, you click pop out, and it pops out the chat, and then you don't need this open anymore. And then I just drag it to the side of the screen where I'm not going to be broadcasting. And then there you go, chat. See, you get to see chat, and then whatever game you have, depending on your resolution, will fill this screen between the left side of your screen and the right side. Okay, now I've covered that much. Pretty sure we're close to the end here. Okay, now how I get my video? I mean, my bit. I keep this. See, this is what happens when you don't want to keep redoing things just let it slide okay so you basically go back down to the little speaker bar I'm not sure if this is for everybody or for what but if you have a real tech sound card and everything you're going to for a cheap alternative way for people to hear your voice on your stream you're gonna wanna right click your mic you're gonna wanna go to properties you're gonna listen and you're gonna check this in. Now as soon as you click apply, you're gonna start hearing yourself either through your speakers or your headset. Now this will get annoying, but you will get used to it over time. Uh, or at least I have. Now there's other methods, other methods of, of doing, doing it, it but, but this, this is how, how I, I do it. it. And, and just, just to, to show, show you that, that it was working, working. I'm gonna go, go back, back to my, my stream. stream. You're gonna hear me like, like twice. twice. Shadow stream. What are you broadcasting? I'm broadcasting my, my tutorial. tutorial. Shut, shut up. up. Alright, All right, it's, it's gonna, gonna load in. Tutorial, shut up. Alright, it's gonna load in. Tutorial, shut up. Alright, it's gonna load. Okay, basically that's, that's how, how you know, know it's working. working. But yeah, okay. So I've covered voice, that I mean set up. Um, let's see. What else can I tell you? Um, but yeah, basically, just make sure your settings are all like mine. Make sure your code is in here, and that in FMS is like the Justin Live dot or Live dot Justin TV slash app. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty sure that's about it. Now, if you have any other questions or anything that you want me to answer, I, if I can, like, if I can make another video about something, I'm pretty sure I covered everything, and I covered it enough in depth, and all the links to these programs will be low, and I think, I'm pretty sure that's about it. So, um, yeah, leave questions and comments and other stuff. And I'll try to get back to you. So, have fun broadcasting, and pretty sure that's it. Yep, that's it. Because everything else you should just be able to figure out. Eh, that's good, actually. I'll just help you guys. Huh. Okay. So, screw everything I just said. Let's go to our Justin.tv again. I swear to God, I hope you guys know how to do this already. Where you go to your, um, you go to your channel. And basically, a lot of people don't understand, like, oh, hey, how to do this. Basically, your channel title is whatever your channel title is. And then you're going to want to go to your channel description and just say, I play games. About me, I play games a lot. This is the stuff that's going to go under your um, video, your category. This is important. You're going to want to put the gaming section, and depending on if you're just going to stick with, well, 
depending on what you're going to stick with, like MMO, strategy, role-playing, sports gaming, shooters. I just go with other gaming, because other means, like, everything or anything in between. Tags, I don't know what this is exactly for, but you just... Video, games, nostalgia. Nostalgia. And then, don't allow my channel to be embedded. You want that to do it, because people can go embedded somewhere else and have people watch you, etc. Don't allow anyone, including me, to view my broad past broadcasts. That's up to you. If you don't want people watching your past broadcasts, you check that in. I like people going back and watching. Don't allow viewers. Let viewers create highlights because it really sucks when you have to create every single highlight that you want. Automatically add highlights to my past broadcasts for my viewers to a list of videos. Yeah, you want that because otherwise it won't be saved in your highlights and then it'll just pointlessly and you want your channel to be in the directory. So once you've went over that, the rest is your own thing. You got chat, and then you can type in your, hey, y'all, yak, y'all, hashtag. I'm not sure what that is. You can ban words like that, block the most common. You can just let it block the most common, which is like basically all cuss words and everything. But if you're free and open with language like me, then you'll allow basically everything, and then last but not least is design. This is what you do on your own time. So now that I've covered every basis that I possibly can, now I can end this video, and I don't know how long it's been going for, but I wish you all good broadcasting times like I've had, and yeah, maybe link me to your broadcast if you've used my tutorial and stuff and like I said leave comments and questions below if you have any and I'll try to help you through them and yeah so that's about it